so theory of mind means if, if, if children or any other species possess a theory of mind, that means they know that others know, that others think, that others have d desires, that other ha others have beliefs about the current reality that might be different from current reality. So I, for example, might believe that an object is in box A, although it actually is in box B. And for a long time it has been thought that children do not understand others' beliefs, for example, before the age of four. And those were um, results that were gained from studies on so-called explicit studies. So, um, kids were asked where people would look for objects and things like that, so children had to respond verbally to those questions. Um, in the last, I would say, seven to eight years, there's been findings that even infants seem to show some at least precursors of this theory of mind by looking differently according to what the protagonist of a video clip, for example, what, what uh, he believes where the object it would be or what the object is, they show different looking behavior. And so these um, results have, have been seen as evidence that there might be something going on even earlier than four years of age. Um, whereas in my research now, we are trying to find kind of a bridge in between or between those two perspectives. So we're looking for studies that are not explicit, where the kids do not have to say anything, um, but to get an, a response measure that is more than just looking, which is uh, actually helping or doing something. So um, we also manipulate the protagonist's belief and then see whether uh, infants, uh, most of the studies are done with 18 month olds, uh, whether infants differentiate in their response behavior according to the protagonist's belief. And what we find is that we now tried three different paradigms, so there are different tasks which you could do with kids, even verbally or non-verbally, and in all of those three tasks we now found evidence that infants actually do response, uh, respond differently according to the protagonist's belief. So it means that there is, seems to be something going on even before the age of four. And this is additional evidence for the looking time studies that actually uh, claim to find false belief understanding in, at an, in infants at an age before the age of four, for example, uh, one, sorry, the age of one. So in even very, very pre-verbal infants.